What's up you guys? This is another action figure review. In this video I'm going to be reviewing Play Arts Kai's Resident Evil 6 Leon Kennedy figure. This is the Leon figure that I've been waiting for. So I was very happy when I saw this was coming out. Alright, let's go over this bad boy. Okay, now posability. So the head is on a ball joint. This figure has crazy amounts of posability as expected with a Play Arts Kai figure. Um, shoulder folds out like that, it goes 360. And it's also got a little thing that pops out there so that the shoulder can move across the torso a little bit farther. Um, elbow twists both at the top near the bicep and at the bottom of the, at the forearm and then of course it bends and does all this stuff and same for the other arm he's on a ball joint at the mid torso so he can do this do that twist around whatever you want also at the hip same thing do this turn around do that and whoop de do. Okay, so at the hip, leg goes about that high, that far back, pops out, twists to a degree, not all the way, but whose leg does. Okay, double jointed knees, which look a little bit awkward, but it's fine. And, um, foot's on a little swivel joint right there. It can do some bob and weaving a little bit. And uh, it doesn't really twist. It's mostly that bob and weave you have to work with, but that's fine. And same for the other leg, of course. Now I kind of want to go over the detail on this figure. Detail is incredible. As you can see, it's even got the little mic piece right there. It's got a little the flashlight, too, up here. And um, you can see Leon's 5 o'clock shadow. And... The leather jacket is made of a rubber material, so it's different and it's flexible. I think that's really cool. And of course, the leather jacket sleeves feel different, like a different material than the pants do, just because of the different texturing that they did. So yeah, I'm not sure if the jacket comes off, but I'm not going to try it, because why would I want it to come off? Anywho's. Moving on to accessories. So Leon has two interchangeable hands to hold the guns that he comes with. He comes with both the wing shooters, which are his uh, signature gun, basically a reference to his Resident Evil 2 weapon. And, um, then he also has the assault rifle RN, which is of course Leon's main assault rifle throughout the Resident Evil 6 campaign, the famous bayoneted AK-47 style weapon. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and put that one on right now. Just pop this hand off, put this hand on. And because of interchangeable hands, he can hold it with two. Okay, so we have that. And now we'll go ahead and put the wing shooters on. This one's a little bit tricky because the whole tab likes to come out. Oh, but I didn't that time. I wanted to, though. I could feel it. Alrighty. So I'm going to go ahead and set them to the side right here and show you the last accessory, which is... Hold on, it's a little loose. The figure stand, which you can assemble yourself. And this part pops off, as does this, so you can adjust the height to which you want him to hold your Leon. So if you want him in like a jumping pose, you can make it a little bit higher. And it comes with two different sets of grips, a smaller one and a larger one, depending on how you have your Leon positioned, which is um, really cool. I didn't know what 
the larger things were for at first because it only showed instructions on how to assemble this one then I realized oh it's just the same thing just bigger so you do that open it up get Leon right there and now he's good but the one thing about this figure is that it stands really well on its own so you don't have to really worry too much about the base Okay, and now I just wanted to kind of comment a little bit on this figure. So, I love this figure. This is the Leon action figure that I have been waiting for for a long, long time. Um, the only thing that even came close to this good was the Palisades one, which I also have. I just barely got that one. And, um, but this is, because uh, Leon is my favorite Resident Evil 6 character. It's Leon, Nemesis, Vector, and Hunk. That's the... My hierarchy, basically. And also, I kind of wanted to show you this comparing to Big Red right here. That's how tall the figure is. And, um, yeah. So they did an amazing job recreating my favorite, probably my favorite protagonist of all time, Leon. And um, I'm so happy that they made this figure. And I highly recommend it to any Resident Evil fan. So, yeah. Well, that concludes this video. If you have any questions, please send me a private message to my YouTube inbox instead of commenting. Please do not add me on Xbox Live, but feel free to add me on Steam. You can find my account in the link here. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.